In this video, I'm going to be talking about setting up an AutoCAD template file with different ArcGIS for AutoCAD elements that are going to assist me in extracting data from my data that I keep on ArcGIS server. And I'm going to be doing that through a feature service. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and access the template file that I've already created. And I see that there's a, a map service already connected in this drawing. So whenever I load up ArcGIS for AutoCAD with such a drawing, it's going to make a connection to the server. Um, so now I have a map service in my drawing. I also have a geographic coordinate system defined um, for the area that I'm going to be working in. So that's already set up for me. Um, I also have uh, map services, like I mentioned before. I also have some imagery in this drawing that I can turn on, and I'm already connected to that. So I'm going to go ahead and extract some data from my project site. So I'm going to go ahead and just use the online locator to navigate to my um, project site and then zoom in closer to um, the candidate that best fits the description of my project area and so now I'm looking at the area um, that I want to extract data well in my template file I've also anticipated where things are going to land in my drawing and I've set up the, the different color um, and line types in my drawing so that when features land in this drawing they're going to be colored the way I want I've also included block definitions that match the feature service name so that when point features are created they're going to be using my symbology that I want to use um, I also have connections to blank feature class layers. So I've already connected to the server to the features that I or the, the feature data that I want to extract. So there's essentially blank feature layers in this drawing already and I'm going to use the um, set um, service limit from the current view to refresh my drawing with um, features from the server. So you see them being drawn here. Um, now I'm focusing in on this area and I'm bringing entities into this drawing. So right now um, I have a read-only connection um, live back to the database um, for all of these entity, entities. But what I'm going to do is I want to extract these as a, a separate AutoCAD drawing so that um, this is my own local copy without a connection back to the database because I want to share this information with someone else. So I do have attributed feature classes here in my drawing but these are all now bound locally or all contained completely within the DWG file um, so that I can share it with others. So um, I can zoom in and I've got all my symbology that I'm, I'm used to um, seeing in my AutoCAD drawing I hear like this AutoCAD block that was um, generated again according to my anticipated name of the feature layer and so now I can share this drawing with others that don't have a connection to my server and I can start doing my design. 